Hello everyone, my name is Butter Tongsley, fresh from the fridge, and welcome back to another episode of Disgaea 5. Where we left off, we have recruited into our group Usaria. Usalia. Blah. Not Usaria. Blah. Uh, she is now part of our group, and apparently she counts as a monster class, which is kind of interesting. <clears throat> so now we have another monster. Oh, well, we have a new one because I am no longer using geese because uh, I do want to use the main characters, and also I have added myself into the game with my friends. I am. A private rabbit. So yeah, this is this is actually going to be kind of interesting. Uh, one thing I will do quickly is get him into a group. Possibly, I don't know. But I'll d I'll decide that later on. So. Before we continue our adventure, one thing is, what? we have new research finished. Blood Parch is complete. So I'm interested to see there. what has happened here. Imp has declared war, defeated Imp, attempted, uh, attempted ambush witch, defeated witch. Mm -hmm. So, so far... So far, that, you know, like, it's listed out of all the things they did throughout the days. We've gotten items. No gate negotiations with the orc failed. Discovered a gate to Terrible Dawn NW. What is that? Oh, and I can actually choose, um... What the cell? Pretty cool. Is there a way I can, like, take the stuff? Do I have to sell it? I think I already have this stuff. I just gotta pretty much decide what to do with it. So, yeah, by the looks of it, most of it's just gotten free loot. Obtained save icon Red Magnus. Okay. So, that was actually pretty good. So, let me check to see if we have the stuff. Do we? No, we don't. So, it's just what? in there. So, we just gotta decide what to, to sell. There. Uh, it's... Oh, so this is like obtaining the stuff, and if I click enter and enter, it'll take the stuff that we want. So right now it's confirmed that we want to take the stuff, so I'll get rid of the weaker stuff that I don't need. Hold on to the weapons... Just give me one second, I'll be right back. Alright. Uh, Alright. Discovered Terrible Dawn and you added to the index. Red Magnus. This site is the largest information database. They say uh, if you can't find what you're looking for here, it doesn't exist. Okay. It's a level 6 area. Yeah, sure. Let's bring them there. All right.
What, am I not allowed to use the same people? I no, they're still here, so why are they... I don't get it. Where's Jess? Did I just not see his name? Oh, wait, his name's right here. Duh. All right, here they go. They're off to research Terrible Dawn NW. I'll be interested to see what they bring when they come back. All right, so <clears throat> we are going to continue where we left off in the story. Uh. But I did say also, before we do that, I'm going to quickly do this. Because we do have a new overlord to try and recruit. So I figured I might as well show him in this video. Because I'm interested to see the new ones. <clears throat> Erender Z. Ha 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 I am Erender Z, the overlord of the Munchroom. Yee! So the over overlord of the Munchroom was a munch mushroom after all. Blech, my words... A mushroom? How rude, ye! I am a legit legitimate erring ye! Ah, I'm getting hungry. Kill ya, cook me something with mushrooms. Let's see, how about grilled veggies and sliced erring ye? Stop right there, ye! Or it might be erring ye. Ahem. If you can defeat me, I'll lend you a hand, ye! Come at me like there's no tomorrow! Okay, let's come at him like there's no tomorrow. Alright, uh, he's being defended by three up front. He's a level 25. Ooh. And of course, because he is... That he does have the... Well, actually, he has a little bit different resistances. The ones up front, though, they are very vulnerable to monster weapons and swords. Okay. And... They're the same. Then also fire. He's vulnerable to wind. And swords and axes. Alright. What the hell is that she is riding? Ah, wrong thing. How do I- oh yeah, the zoom is... Uh, this... That looks like one of the yellow printies, but it's big and fat! And she rolls on it. Hold on, let me see you move again. <laughs> oh my god, are you serious? This is actually kind of fun to roll around with. <laughs> okay. I also found out how to turn them around. Apparently it all revolves around uh, the mouse wheel. So if I do this, it allows me to turn them around. So I should actually, uh, probably use the mouse wheel a little bit more. Although, it sometimes is hard to move around with the mouse. As you can see, it can sometimes get stuck. But we're good here. So I say we start this off. There we go. I'm happy, Flip. Yeah, and apparently the rabbits, uh, they can have the same, uh, way of talking like Usalia. So I decided to give it to him because it's actually kind of funny and adorable that they say Flip at the end. <coughs> Alright. Good thing I gave him shield. Good thing, too, because that was a crit. Oh, and he already has revenge. 
Oh wait, that's right, he was an inch away from getting it. It's gonna get very annoying having to hear them say the same thing over and over, but... We're gonna have to deal with it. This might hurt. Did nothing. Let me thank you. Hey! Killer Spin! We have a new sword ability! Oh yeah, that's another thing also is I, uh, like, I don't, I didn't, like, give it to him to be, like, his primary weapon, but for some reason he has his, uh, sword as his, right now, uh, he right now has the sword as the primary weapon. Apparently I can change it? Does it, does it use a turn? It might not. Oh! I don't want to do that. Wait, so how do I make it so that he swaps it? Isn't there a way to, like... Hmm. Maybe he, like, swaps it depending on the moves he uses. Alright, what's this? That's a singular target hit. That's actually rather nice. But you know what? Since you're in a row, let's do the blade rush so I can hit both of you. I'll give you a good punch. And we'll be able to kill you. And we'll be able to try out this one's new attack. I'm actually interested. Flat? Or what did it say? Yeah, I thought it said fatty dance. No, it's flatty dance. Rabbits pounding rice cakes. No argument here. Actually, that sounds kind of delicious. I would like a rice cake. Hundred percent accuracy. Alrighty. And let's... Ah, crap, can't... Alright, for now then, I will heal you. And I'm gonna execute first. One dead. And this one's two. And I ranked up. I'm no longer a private. I am a corporal. You okay? I think that's what CPL means. Corporal. It kind of makes sense that it means corporal. Alright. Seraphina's not gonna be able to do much here except for maybe activating... Uh, her ability to charm them. So why don't we use that to our advantage? Especially since you're males. Bing! Charmed. Alright, so they are going to attack their leader if we kill that one quick enough. And speaking of, I'm actually going to have you moved over there. And I'm gonna move you here. And why not hit you both? How much resistance to... Alright, you have zero resistance, so you pretty much just take normal damage. And move him here. And, hmm, I have an idea for that. You know what? 
me and Usali are gonna sneak attack. Here comes the rabbit squad! Well, the Toto Bunny squad. Yeah, that sounds better. And you know what? Before Aspen actually does that, I am going to hit you with armor break so that you can be more vulnerable to at least take a little bit more damage from her attack. And... Kale, I'll have moved here. And you already did something before, that's right, so... With these hands. Here. <laughs> he gets down. Alright, did zero off the bat, but they... Oh, okay, so... I thought they were going to probably attack their leader, or at least one of them will, and the other one attacks the other, but nope, they're just gonna hit each other by dancing each other to death. But they didn't do much to each other. Interesting voice for that one. I can't tell if it's a girl or a boy, though. The voice could be a tomboy girl, for all I know. But I have a plan of why I'm moving my rabbit characters here. Because now... I uh, don't know if that's going to reach. Hold on, let me see. My plan is to Montos this and hit them with it. If it was just a little bit closer over here... Then I could have aimed it right here and hit all three of them. <clears throat> How far can you, Montos? Not that far at all, so okay. Usalia and Montosing? Yeah. Not a big thing. So, we're just going to have to settle for hitting the Overlord, and hopefully this hits him. It hit that one. Well, at least it hit one of them. was hoping it would hit both, really. Oh, yeah. And I'm gonna do this so that you can be able to move again. There we go. You got your speed back. I kind of wish you were in a better position so I could have hit both of you. This one's called Olaf. Well, Olaf. Same name that's used in a um, series of unfortunate events. I actually just finished watching the whole season of that too, series of unfortunate events. I loved it. Really wish they, uh... I wish, uh, they, like, maybe, like, continue it with, like, their own extended stories, but they did all the books, which I'm still glad they did, because, like I said, it was awesome. It was one of the most amazing things, uh, it was, like, it was one of the most amazing series I've ever seen. And I'm also gonna do this. And end it. There you go. Get you both. And finish you off. Wow, dude! With these hands. Break your armor. And now squad attack! It's my turn. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's right. She's in her own squad. 
Yeah, she's in her own squad that, uh... Wow, that was, a uh, one hell of an attack. But anyway, yeah, like, uh, I forgot that Serafina's in her own squad where she manages her, uh, pocket netherworld. I forgot about that. But that's fine. And I don't have to unparalyze, uh, Kilia because he's already in position to be able to attack. With these hands. With that blade not even having a perfect tip for it to do that spin, that looks like it hurt. Wow, you have a lot of health. Whoa, wait, and Dom- He just healed a bunch of HP! He pretty much got himself all the way back to- And he has over 3,000 HP, I just realized. Yeah, I'm gonna have to really just pummel you as much as I can. Broke his armor, so he's more more vulnerable. I was trying to think of the word. I went completely brain dead. Nice. <laughs> Brilliant, Guy. You guys are the first to ever wound me. Overlord Erender Z will help you guys, Guy. You should be thankful. The Overlord of the Munchroom, Erender Z, has become an ally. Ah, I got I got sliced on my mushroom tip. I need to go to the hospital first, Guy. You guys go report that you've completed the quest in the meantime, Guy. Wait, his mushroom tip just got sliced off, and before... Oh, I leveled up. Uh, but yeah, before... Magnus said that he was hungry, and Kilia brought up using them for an ingredient in something he's gonna cook. I feel like they didn't accidentally cut off. The tip of his mushroom top. Son tells me that was intentional. Let's fix you up. Now we're gonna quickly turn this in. And we got him. Aaron Z. Anything new? Most of it's same stuff. There's a few things in here for tutors, but I can always grab that sometime in the future. So I'm going to quickly save after all that. <coughs> and yeah, we're going to now Where would you like to continue to? our story. We're going to Isis Hell, a snow planet. It actually looks kind of interesting. And is that a snow cone maker? Is that a snow cone maker sitting on top of a mountain? I mean... I'm okay with it. 
And that's a really nice igloo down there with horns. That is actually a really nicely made igloo. Alright, so. Freezing Tundra. Decrease water resistance by 50%. I feel like we're going to face a lot of people with ice. And water abilities. That's not going to be fun. <sighs> it's cold. Are the lost really here? It's cold, but it ha it's actually pretty. What's with the colorful frozen cube things? The information about the lost being in Isaac Hell came from your Prinny. Huh. If their information is wrong, then those Prinnies will be frosted by the chilling breath of an ice maiden. What's wrong, little Usa? Are you cold too? About the coldness. Watch! Just blow it super away with your muscles! Wait, you can blow away the cold breeze with your mu oh, muscles alone, Magnus? Aren't you like a guy with like fiery hair and all that? So aren't you able to like maybe heat yourself up? So why say it's your muscles? I feel like you are hiding a certain ability. Are you scared? Are you all not scared, Flip? When your enemy is Void Dark, that means 10 billion lost soldiers are out to get your life. Among them is the demon general who cast that spell on me. That is exactly what Red Magnus Super desires. To beat up that pile of monkey crap Void Dark and become the strongest overlord. Pile of monkey crap. The strongest overlord? If I can avoid combat, I'd prefer not to fight. But when they attack, I will fight <coughs> back. And without mercy. I do not enjoy barbaric fights, but I will resist anyone who tries to take away my freedoms till the very end. All of the men you see here are my servants, tasked with fulfilling those duties for me. <laughs> uh -huh. You are all so strong. I don't have that kind of strength. That's why my mother and father were killed by the demon general, and my homeworld was destroyed. But I still live on in shame. I would have been my father's successor as the overlord of Toto Bunny. I should get revenge and take back my home world, but I want to be strong like you guys and get revenge for my parents, Flip. If a child like her wants to get revenge for her parents, she must have received a lot of love from them. Love? No, no, such a thing doesn't exist for demons. I wouldn't say that in the past Sky games, that's been a major thing. This girl is probably planning something. Revenge for your parents. Revenge. Revenge is too heavy of a burden for a child to carry on their shoulders. You probably shouldn't try. I know, Flip. But if I can't do that, then my life will have no purpose. That's sad. Oh. It's the lost. Everyone, get in formation. We've finally found you, Usalia of Toto Bunny. Huh. You want little Usa, huh? How immature. All you adults ganging up on one little child. You guys are the rebel army, aren't you? We've been authorized to kill you on sight. Obey or die. You guys no longer have any right to choose. Die. She just poofs that printy out of nowhere and sits on it. That's kind of adorable. Netherworld effect snow is active. Alright, so we're more vulnerable to ice and let me guess. You guys have ice magic, don't you? Yep. Alrighty. And they got resist break, so I gotta be careful of them if they decide to resist break me. I can't tell. Oh, okay, that's separate paths. I thought that was like just lines on one big giant road. Uh, 
All right. Let's go. Just going in this area, we go from 50 ice resistance to zero. This is... Oh, boy. Oh, you have... Negative resistance to spears. I'm gonna have to plan this out carefully. But then again, they also have negative resistance to fist, but more negative to ice and wind. And magic alone, all right. Alright, here we go. So we're gonna do this to boost our resistance. And then boost their evasion. Boost their hit. And boost Kilia's damage. Because right now we can't reach them. But they're gonna come straight for us, probably. And they're gonna combine. Oh wow, that flying. He's literally a tiny version of himself on a cannon. I would've... Like, most of the time, monsters change into, like, monster variants of the weapon. This one, they just shrunk onto a cannon. Oh, yep, they're moving towards us. Ooh. Alright. Yeah. Aha. You guys are screwed. See ya. You hurt your own just to hit one of us. That was dumb of you. And you didn't even aim for the one that's up there with you. It's a good thing we have Aspen as a Kanoichi. And oh my god, Cronin's an inch away from death. I'm gonna heal both of you. See ya. And that should be a good. Pop dead. And you're dead. Well, one of you might be dead. Hey. I'll try, Flip. Because I'm happy, Flip. You okay? All right, we're getting him. We're getting him. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. And that. And that. That's gonna hurt more. 
Okay, so what they did hurt a little more. Just a little. And I'm gonna have my guy finish you off. Alright. <clears throat> yeah, they didn't heal much, but at least it healed a little bit. And you're dead. And wish you were poisoned, but you're not. And you should be dead. <clears throat> Alright, just one left. She's alive! And you, you dick! Yeah! I don't think anyone died. Yes. Peggy surrendered. And we got a cutscene. If you guys are with me, I'll only cause more trouble for you, Flip. One who murdered my parents, destroyed my homeworld, and is still coming after me is Demon General Majorita, Flip. She is very persistent, Flip. I bet she won't stop coming after me until she kills me. Demon General Majorita is that girl. I was right. It's the one with the undead. Do you guys know her, Flip? Yeah, we've encountered her before. It's a miracle <clears throat> that you guys have faced her and still live, Flip. That's impressive. Come to think of it, she said something about a girl with a yellow prinny. She must have been talking about you, Usalia. Does that mean our lives were spared because of Usalia? <coughs> Maybe she'll be able to help us. I don't mind having you as one of my servants. Y yeah. Ha! <laughs> don't be stupid. You're saying that little brat spared our lives? If we fought back, the Supreme One would have super won, of course. <laughs> You really can say anything with that cocky mouth of yours. You are the strongest all talk overlord. Uh, you bitch! So that's what happened, Flip. We've all been brought together in unique ways. Well, this is a form of fate. As long as you don't cause any trouble for me, you don't need to be so modest. It's no trouble, little Usa. You're the best bait to lure out that demon general. Right, everyone? Well, I wouldn't call her bait. Usalia is bait. I see. Flip. Well, then again, Understood. yeah. Then I think I can help you guys. Usalia will be your bait, Flip. Let's put the bait idea aside for now. We don't stand a chance against the Demon General, even if we do lure her to us. Lives are at stake in this war. It's pointless if we can't win. What do you all plan to do about this? That's not a problem. We just need to fight, fight, and fight our way through till we take Void Dark's head. What I need to do has never changed. That doesn't solve anything. If we could win battles by just recklessly plowing ahead, Red Magnus would already be in charge. <laughs> you know the Supreme One all too well, little Seasto. Seasto. That wasn't a compliment. It would be easier if only I had more power. Now, hurry up and unleash me. You actually do know, right? That I can kill Void Dark in an instant? Speaking of power, I've been wondering why you all have so much potential but can't exert your true powers. H how should Red Magnus know? Before he knew it, he had gotten weak. You became weak? Is it even possible for an overlord to weaken? <laughs> that sounds like an 
excuse. Weren't you just really weak to begin with? Yeah, right. Red Magnus used to have enough power to split a world in half with his fist. Oh, wait. Split a world in half? That's crazy, Flip! Hmm. Well, that's quite interesting. Something must be the cause of your loss of power, right? Right? Uh, the, the Supreme One hasn't lost anything! <laughs> what is it, Kilia? Men have a secret or two that they don't want anyone to know. Those were your words. Y yeah Then there's no need for us to investigate each other. We were all brought together by coincidence to accomplish the same objective. Huh. Well then. Let's and they have something to that. say. Quickly, I'm going to treat everyone. And let's see what they got. Even though we'll go uh, Margarita, it seems all the demon generals are quite strong opponents. Yeah, but if we're struggling against the demon generals, then we have no shot in defeating Lord Dark. More. I need more power. Oh, I didn't know I could just talk to her and there'd be like a s conversation. I thought that thing had to pop up over there where it shows that there's an event. But, alright, let's talk and see what these two are talking about. <clears throat> Hey, little sea stow, your overlord's skill is super useful. Can you use it to see our potential power, too? <laughs> yes, I can. You finally noticed how great I am. So, when does it come in handy? We were never on the same page. My overlord, my overlord is called Ochi Clairvoyance. It can determine the strength of enemies and track them from far away. And if you can determine your potential, their potential power, then you can avoid uh, inconvenient battles. When I'm able to determine their powers, then I can find out where they are. Are you super serious? All right, prove it by telling Red Magnus where Sarah is. Very well. That's a sim. Well, that's simple enough. She's in this direction. I see. It looks like Seraphina is bathing. All right, Red Magnus will super go check and see if that's true or not. Wait, what? Oh no. Well, it's official. Red Magnus is dead. Oh well, game over. I'm just kidding. He's not even the main. Oh, he's not even the main main character. Anyway, he's one of the main characters. <clears throat> Red Magnus's stupidity is immeasurable, even with my clairvoyance. Again? How many of these do I have to do? I have a favor to ask of two of you. I want you to fight Usalia, Plip. Whoa, you want to go one-on-one -on -one with the Supreme One? Alright, just bring it! Hold on a second, what are you thinking, Usalia? At this rate, Usalia will only slow you guys down, Plip. So to get stronger, I want to train, Plip. So that's it. I thought you were mad at us, so I was a little concerned. I'm sorry for the confusion, Pip. It's alright. This will only lead to the rebel army getting stronger. Of course I'll help. I'm ready to go anytime. Alright, just bring it, little Usa. Alright. Red Magnus, you know that your opponent is a little child, right? Heh, <laughs> yeah, Red Magnus super knows. Arrah! He's activating Super Olympia already? Damn. Holy crap! <coughs> <coughs> he didn't understand at all. Huh? What are you rumbling about, little Sisto? 
Isn't it common sense for demons to crush anyone who charges towards them? That may be so, but how is that supposed to be training? I don't know how to make the sounds that she is making. All I know is... Okay, then. He just pretty much punted her across the entire room. I'm also gonna save. Ooh. E. Had a little bit of indigestion there, but I'm actually all out of time. So, we get some, some decent progress and we get to experience a whole new world. I actually like that snowy world. I wish I was already there uh, to pretty much have that be part of the feeling of the Christmas holidays being Christmas is all about snow and nice things. Um, but, eh, that's fine. Did it for the New Year's. So, with that being said, thank you all so much for watching. Please leave a like, comment, tell us what you think of the of our video. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Take care, all you demons and angels out there. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye. Happy New Year. It's delicious.